dude. I like hockey guys, though. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Yes, it does. Like, I was like, yeah. dude, I love a dude that just has nice flow in his hair and shit and yeah. just likes seeing people fight. Yeah. Like unchecked white aggression. He, yes. <laughs> you know, I went to Arizona State. You know what I'm saying? Like, what do you, you want to fight? I can't fight, but I yeah. want to be engaged. Yeah. 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 I yeah. know two guys that'll do it, I'll and take, I don't even have yeah. to tell them why. Yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I'll take a couple punches. Yeah, right. I got a chin on me, <laughs> dude, and a off. mouth that will lead to the fight. Yeah, but yeah. my boys will finish. And I will say some dude. scathing things about your family I haven't met yet <laughs> that'll set you back for years. <laughs> so you want to go? No, yeah, I like like hockey. The idea of hockey is fun. Playoff hockey. So yeah, in the building for playoff hockey. Yeah, it's crazy. It's fucking it's nuts, dude. nuts. But so think about where I've lived. I grew up in Cincinnati and then uh, Phoenix. So like, Jesus. you know what I'm saying? How, are, how do you yeah. smile? <laughs> Honestly, I had a lot of lotion to keep this thing dry. Um, but uh, yeah, so like the coyotes are fucking whatever. I have I did do the roast of Shane Doan though, so I had to do a lot of research. Who? Uh, exactly. Yeah. Shane Doan? <laughs> Doner? Uh, yeah, yeah. He's like, <laughs> that's why I tell people. Describing Shane Doan to people, it's like Steve Nash of their of the Hockey? Coyotes, but yeah. like, yeah, what does that mean? Yeah, that's like an insult in itself. He's the fucking man, Steve Doan. Uh, Shane Doan, yeah, he's Shane like Doan. he's <laughs> like the greatest. Would you say you're you're in the know on this? I feel like he's like the best Coyote ever. Uh, yeah. Who are some other Coyotes? <laughs> Hobby Bullets. I'm saying Hobby Bullets again. Hobby Bullet? Uh, no, he didn't start uh, as Hobby a Coyote. He, he, I think he did. No, <laughs> Hobby Bullet. I know that name, and I don't know hockey. <laughs> I wasn't known from the Coyotes. I shouldn't have even brought this point up. I yeah. got no further evidence of any. You know names. what? This is what our podcast does. We just start fucking <laughs> yeah, throwing a, things out there that aren't false real. False information. Yeah, no, so Hobby Bullet was a long time. Fire up Hobby Bullet. Coyote. Coyote. <laughs> What'd you get? The, the old. Would you fire this up over here? <laughs> Dude, I don't great, know. Spelling. Greatest coyotes up. of all time. It's actually a YouTube of literal coyotes from the BBC. <laughs> it's like, oh, this is great coyote. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Running the streets. Now, Dude. I do understand that the you know the ferocity of of hockey fans because it is a certain sect of the yeah. populace. Like even in Philly, it's a whole separate group of fans that don't really. They don't mix with everybody. Everybody's yeah. like football. It goes Eagles first, Philly second, yeah. then the Sixers. Well, because Philly's Eagles stadiums are right next to each other, right? Yeah. yeah. Where's the all, Flyers at? They're all right. They're all oh, it's all right there. Yeah. Oh, okay, Dude, but still. Yeah. There were, there, were, there were games like when the when the Phillies were in the World Series. I remember back in like, what was it, 07 or something 08, like that? Yeah. 08. It was like, there were, there were days where there were... Flyers, Phillies, and Eagles games Damn. all on the same day. That's crazy. Right yeah. in this just... Yeah. It was a lot mayhem. of cities can't do that, too, because a lot of the basketball and hockey is the same arena, right? Uh, Yeah. But, well, I guess you're saying Phillies, Eagles, But I'm Flyers. saying that all on the sense. same day, yeah. yeah. Sixers and Flyers. So depending really, on who yeah. won and who lost, day, you yeah. could either pr impregnate your wife <laughs> or beat the shit out of her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. So hockey's like... For me, I don't give a shit about it. But yeah, I get it. Dude, right, the coyotes. that's why I checked on Feidelberg. I was like, dude, you, yeah, you, you, AG, dude. <laughs> he posted a picture or a video. I saw the like, video. Yeah, he's gonna fucking. <laughs> I wanted to make sure he was going towards no bridges. Yeah, dude, right. I just texted him. I was like, hey man, if you want to, you want to get a beer. It was like right. three thirty. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I the like worst how it made you look like a monster, <laughs> but actually you were just like, you're a monster. You could kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you all good? Yeah. I was uh, just looking for a, a beer buddy. <laughs> I was like, you okay, man? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Just know. your normal daily <laughs> drinking. You're like, hey, I'll grab a beer with you. Yeah, yeah. it is. It's been a rough day. I'm already five deep. It is, bro. Yeah, I'm already balls deep. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I actually need somebody. I'm alone. <clears throat> Think about Chris Benoit and his family. <laughs> um, the Coyotes had the sickest thing ever, though, which is the whiteout. Where'd he start? Yeah. Hobby I bowl. agree. Which made Final? the most sense. Hobby like, bowl? the Penn State whiteout's cool, whatever. Yeah, but yeah, the yeah. whiteout for the Coyotes, right. like they're the moon. The yeah, fans yeah, yeah. are the moon. Oh, and howling at the moon? Yes. Oh, now we're cooking. I didn't even get that. I didn't even <laughs> yeah, connect that. Yeah, I dude. like that. Yeah. Yes, dude. The whiteout for the Coyotes. Sick. Also, a little redundant in Arizona. Oh. Whiteout? Come on. <laughs> how do you, a lot of how do you spell Hobby Bowl? K H A B. Whoa, what? Wait, what? Yes. His first name's Hobby. Whoa. Hobby Bullen, dude. You know who's K A H? K H A B I B. Khabibi? It's bringing up uh, Hobby Bullen. That Russian Muslim who kills people. <laughs> Which one? I H A Anderson. <laughs> Yeah. K K A H A K K H K A oh, hold on, hold on. B I B U L I N. Uh, 
Yes. Is this a spell? Holy <laughs> fuck. <laughs> Did he get that right? Oh, what? <laughs> Honestly. Dude, the Indian kid following you is going to be like, I'm sweating, dude. I know. Sweating. That's crazy, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, one of the dumbest people Can I know when I say this, <laughs> That's crazy. That's his savant. We yeah. found his actual thing can, that he's good you at. <laughs> can you use it in a sentence? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Holy shit, dude. <laughs> I literally typed it. I was like, this guy is a Right on. <laughs> Holy shit, yes. Yeah, dude. Uh, All right, he, greatest Arizona Coyote. Of all Winnipeg time. Jets. Is he hobby bull? He's not even on the top twenty. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hold on, that can't be. I don't is know. I mean, is this a ranking though? But you know who's at top? Donor. And I like you guys to stop fucking talking shit about my guy. <laughs> Wait, oh, Jeremy Ronick was a guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a big know. flyer. Yeah. Clayton Keller, the young kid. Okay. He Seems well now he's not as young. Yeah. Kachuk. There's a Kachuk there's him? a there's a dude named Keith Tachuk. Keith Kachuk. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> dude, yeah. What's you, going on? I don't here? know. Yeah, that's I don't like me with like that's, you could just in the nineties you could have dropped any basketball player. I'd tell you what college they went to. That was my dude, only skill Shane set. Is f- unbelievable at that. Yeah. Oh, Shane? Any yeah. any NFL player will tell you what college you went to. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. stupid. It's unnecessary. It's knowledge. very unnecessary. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, it'll be a backup punter for the Jets. He'll be like, Arizona State. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? It's or, like, that was hey, 15 hey, years hey, ago. Hey, we breed them out there. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Or, it's, or it'll be like... team school. It'll be like even crazy. It'll be like Southwest North Dakota right. State. Yeah, yeah, yeah Dude, yeah, listen yeah. to the name of this fucking... It was actually all swack. like, what? There's a team called the Long Beach Ice Dogs. <laughs> in what? That rules. <laughs> in hockey? International Hockey League. It's the Long oh, Beach Ice Dogs. So, I, yeah, in Cincinnati, we had the Cyclones. It was like 10 cent beer night yeah, a lot. Dude. Like, it was a good time. I used to, we used to do that for uh, my birthday every year. We'd go to the uh, Bridgeport Sound Tigers. <laughs> that game. explains so much about you <laughs> as a person. <laughs> hey, every year for my birthday. <laughs> dude, my Where was this brain hockey, yesterday, dude? dude? You were dead yesterday. <laughs> it's <laughs> unbelievable. I was on the ropes yesterday. Dude. Were you? Yeah. I, I, it was like, I woke up. It was. I went to bed at like midnight. Woke up at three a.m. and then just could not get back to sleep. Just, really? Just looked. did you fly to Denver? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, he wasn't that. I had to keep a fucking leash on him. Really? The good thing we had, about it. We had yeah. two pods in a row, but the, That's yeah, the crazy. second one we got to fucking are you garbage? And Chris was just like, oh really? Murder oh, stare to nothing. Which just, that's a tough one to be slow on. Those boys I, 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 I know. Dude. <laughs> we had a slow start. Really? Well, it, yeah, it was it, the, the drive there fucked me up because this guy just sure. took these back roads. Mm-hmm. He got it was pissed the off drive. at the Uber. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It was just, definitely the drive. Dude, he, he literally... He this, the Uber driver had the same name as that occupant. Well, dude... <laughs> he <laughs> wasn't... Happy <laughs> morning! Dude, well, that's how my parents used to put me to sleep to take me for a lap around the block. They would just scream happy bullet. <laughs> <laughs> Slap shots at you. Happy one! Just shaking a rattle. Take you yeah. to a mud dogs game. <laughs> Push you to sleep. <laughs> oh, That's man. Wild. That is how that you'd go to sleep? My mother would just rub JMO in my gums and really? Oh, yeah, my dad used to do that. Yeah, no, they're Irish. Risky. No, I don't. She says she did that. She probably didn't. I hope not. You don't, why not? I, it, it, the problem was Chris it was, was the, Chris was 16. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I had like a big child seat in the back. Yeah. You had a big exam the next day. <laughs> <laughs> like, mommy. Give me a couple laps, dude. Uh, the SATs are tomorrow. Dude, I could never get to sleep in high school. I actually, I was like that I too. I could never get to sleep. I was like that too. I used to sleep in class. I figured out this way where I could like, I'd put my hood over my head and I'd pretend like I was reading a textbook and I would just... Snooze. I could. I what would. What kind of teacher's but, not picking I would, that up? You were just you were just memorizing hockey players on the bench. <laughs> <laughs> Third line guys. How to spell Dude, I was. I was just drawing pictures of Mark Ambro. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's ridiculous. Dude, my dad. Uh, my dad missed my brother's birth because he was at the Flyers, the Stanley Cup. Oh really? I thought yeah. he was snoozing. Seventy four. Oh, yeah. really? He was driving around the block <laughs> sleeping. My dad didn't miss any any births. In fact, his firstborn son was my brother. We only got like there's three of us, but my brother was the second born and uh he didn't know that i guess your balls are really large when you are born yeah they're small. and so his what? first words after his, my, my brother was born he says what a set of nuts huh <laughs> like elbowing the doctor like you see that that's my boy yeah. <laughs> sir it's a girl <laughs> yeah exactly well, that's concerning wait why do you why do your balls swell i actually don't know science on that uh i mean i don't know Is it because you're getting squeezed through the birth canal just, no, no, and I it's just, like a, it's like a, it's like a release valve. Uh, I think it's just backup nutrition. 
They just where you store all your your first day's meal and your nuts. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The You're umbilical cord is connected to the balls. <laughs> I don't know. You've been in some pussy for nine months and you haven't been able to bust. <laughs> it's true. It's, fucking, it's you know true. Yeah, you got blue it. balls. Yeah, yeah. You, got, you come out with blue balls. <laughs> that's why you love your mother. It's Freudian. Yeah, yeah. That's, they don't, they don't. <laughs> that's why you fall in love with your mom at five and you chase her your whole life. <laughs> Yeah, you don't know don't, language. You're just begging her to jerk you off. Yeah, exactly. They don't exactly. like talking just, about that in the medical textbooks. So you have to jerk a kid off. As soon as <laughs> <laughs> Dad's like, I make can't this kid here come. Make yeah. this kid come. Make the boy come. <laughs> We're gonna Happy lose him. <laughs> oh Heart rate's dropping. Heart rate's dropping. <laughs> that's why they accidentally beat a kid off so hard. That's why the circumcision happened. True. That's, that's that's the skin the came off one time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a little too hot. See, we are a science podcast. Yeah. Science, and, hockey. science and hockey. Science Check in with you. <laughs> the best of both worlds. Yeah. You guys you just transfer to Bloomberg next week. How was uh, college at Arizona State? I hear, I hear wonderful things. It's great. Ripping and roaring. I, I went 18, 19. I was like, you know, freshman year. And you're just ready to leave where you're from. So Cincinnati. I was like, get the fuck out of here. And then you just realize it's just a hodgepodge of kids either escaping something. Yeah. Uh, or they're affluent enough where they could have gone anywhere, or they're the they hot- just wanted a party. Yeah, yeah, right. And then, or uh, it's the hottest. I always say it's like the hottest five chicks from every high school in America. Like one of them goes there. Yes. Yeah. yeah so yeah, like yeah. just smoke shows. You're falling into undeserved pussy. Yeah. Which is the best pussy. God. Yeah. Yeah. Because um, yeah. there's too much. God. The numbers don't add up. Yeah. You know what I mean? They're gonna settle for me. Yeah. And my um, balls are swelling up right now. I feel like I was just born again. <laughs> <laughs> you got Tyler nuts right now, dude. And and, uh, and so that was good. But then also like all your homies, like most of my dudes that I met freshman year. I would say 60, 70 percent of them didn't make it to sophomore year. Yeah, um, I ended up graduating, <laughs> but yeah. uh, like four or five years because I was like in debt. I was out there like escaping real trauma. You know, yeah. what I, mean? and I was like, I actually don't want to go back to Cincinnati at all. Yeah. Uh, be going back, selling the same weed, doing the same shit, and yeah. all that stuff. So it's funny. Like I, I went to engineering school, and they literally said, like, look to your left, look to your right. Only one of you. We'll we'll be here. Yeah, by senior year. <laughs> yeah, you guys yeah, did yeah. that, but it was for like all f- it was fucked s- up reasons. Sophomore year, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, just for booze and drugs. Yeah, exactly. And plus <laughs> right, exactly. He, the, the, the dude to your right is gonna OD. The dude to the left is gonna get gonorrhea. <laughs> Probably OD. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. OD on Jude. And yeah. Dude, I can't stress enough how different Drexel. It was then spiders fuck, didn't then, go as hard <laughs> than Arizona State. <laughs> yeah. Dude, dude the dragons, terrible. Mario the dragon, dude. <laughs> what yeah. is that? Your, yeah, who is Drexel? It's it? dragons. dragons yeah. Oh, dragons. Yeah. Who's the spiders? And the, oh, the pussy there was terrible. <laughs> dude, <laughs> it was trash. Dude, pussy. Terrible. No, the pussy there had a calculator on it, dude. It was <laughs> like it was all it was, it was Asians and Indians and my my okay. whole. I was I was like I one got a of, hankering for heavy set Asian bro. <laughs> no, Me too. no, dude. This yeah. was dude a thick Asian. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. This was weird commuter <laughs> Philly girls. Asian with natties. That's how you describe them. Asian with Dude, natties. Asian with a big fat ass or natties? See ya. Oh, yeah. That'll fuck me up for a couple hours. I'm out in California. <laughs> they exist. Yeah? A lot of Asians out there. Yeah, yeah. true. And, and cool Asians. The whole Pacific too. Northwest is really big. This is what I say about the California Asians. I was like, it's crazy that they're cool Asians because I'm from Ohio. They're not cool yeah. everywhere. You yeah, know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. No. Like, I've, this is the only place I've ever lived in LA where I've been like looking at Asians and be like, where'd you get those shoes at? Yeah. Those yeah. Are yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah. <laughs> like, and they're like, not doctor shoes. They're dope, yeah, they're good. They're fucking <laughs> they're up tall, on style. Yeah. Tall yeah. fit. Yeah. Yeah. You're like, what the fuck? They're not Yao Ming freakish, yeah. but it's like, dude, you're six one, bro. Yeah. What's up? <laughs> I'm a huge oh, fan yeah. of that, like that futuristic Asian uh fashion. Oh yeah! Like I fucking love how that looks. Like yeah. everything in Blade Runner with Gosling. I can't. Yeah, yeah. I just like, can't wear it. Like I. It's no, like, of course not. Yeah, it's like me, it's like me dressing like a skater. Like I can't fucking do it. Like I wanna. Yeah. I bought this Adidas jacket. You would like it. But you're close to like you're you're you could do like Final Fantasy Seven hair. No, dude. Yeah. yeah no, no. <laughs> first of all, first of all, you could switch some shit up. <laughs> but you also look like a dude that just rocks solid colored shirts and a chain over it every yeah, day. Yeah. yeah. You, Keep it simple, yeah. but that's what the age, the futuristic age. It's like very muted colors. It's it's earth tones, but the shapes also of things neon. are long and, yeah. and uh, you know elaborate. It's like like baggy they're too? shaped, yeah, very baggy. Yeah. They're very sharp edges. It fucking looks great. They all look like Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, yeah. 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 like Dude, fucking Cloud Strife. Yeah. Not the I hair. Was more, I was the more of a Tomb Raider clothes. guy. I didn't go fan of Final Fantasy. <laughs> Me too, dude. I did Twisted Metal too. Hell yeah. I was on PlayStation, but I didn't do that. I was. Those guys were like. That was my last game I've ever played. Was Tomb Raider. I'm 43. Yeah, I'm 36. Tomb Raider PlayStation was like, dude, it was like 
it was like VR at that yeah. time. It was like, whoa, which is crazy because her tits were like triangles. Yeah. Oh my god, but, I know. But, but I JO do it. Oh, the one time wow, you fucking get the butler in the back dude. door, all of a sudden she's stripping in her thing. You know the code, dude. I had her, I had her <laughs> shimmying on the yeah. wall back and forth yeah. to see her hip swing. Dude. Right, she was so hot, fucking just dangling above a tiger. Like, yeah. let's go <laughs> <laughs> with double desert eagle. <laughs> dude, these autistic teenagers don't know what they have. Hundred percent. There was no porn really. What was the like, sexual dude. awakening? Tomb Raider one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> also, that game was sick. It was like oh, the first action dude. with puzzles. You're like, it's all, got it all. Did you it, ever yeah. get into video game porn? You ever go down like a? Mm. You ever have a couple weeks where you go 3D? <laughs> what, what is that? <laughs> I was about to break down like story concepts in the second one with you. Dude, just don't, don't look at me. Don't look at me. He's like, so did you ever get into the? <laughs> you ever jerk off the Marge Simpson? <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. No, I never did that. Well, we got you on the couch here. No, I can't do that. I got caught once. Jerking off to Marge Simpson? No, I went, uh, family guy, what's her face? Oh, She's Lois. hot Lois. Shit. She yeah. is yeah. thick. Yeah. yeah. I got caught in the, the, you know how they just put, like, they put crazy ads yes. in the thumbnails? Yeah. Lois was you getting pounded, and I was like, yeah. hey, let's see what's going on. Yeah. Out of curiosity, yeah, I've double-clicked one with, <laughs> with the broad with one eye from Futurama. I've always been into it. Yes, <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah, totally. <laughs> I was actually fucking around, but you've been like, that's yeah. too quick of a yes to yes. not be real. <laughs> yes. She was yes. so hot. She yeah, was she so was, hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I never watched that show. That was a good one. That was Simpson. The same. So did you same stop? Art. Did you stop playing video games after that? <laughs> I was like, so did you stop Jay Owen? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. So no, I I made it to Xbox because um, yeah. in college I had a buddy that had, knew a dude in Houston. So he's like, give me your Xbox. I'm gonna ship it back. They're gonna ship it to us. All of a sudden it comes back with Scarface stickers. I was like, what the fuck did this guy do? Just yeah. put a sticker on it. He modded it out. So we had the <laughs> Xbox in college that had like. Every arcade game you could think of. Damn. Uh, we had um, a lot of N64 and shit like that. Some of the games didn't work, but like we people would be coming over, we'd be running it up with like uh, Capcom versus Marvel. You know, yeah, remember that shit? Yeah, with yeah. like you get two guys from here, two guys from there. Fucking Spider Man and Mega Man. Fuck you. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> See me tonight. And then and then we do drinking games with that Mario Party shit like that. Dude. So that was, but that wasn't like. We weren't playing really new games, maybe Madden. Yeah. But we were literally using this Xbox to play it. Oh, yeah. It was great. Dude, it was a I, good I used to do that at work house. all the time. I would download like an NES mod yeah. and just fucking play Little League Baseball. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what, like RBI Baseball or no, Little League Baseball for, I don't know that one. for Nintendo? It's the fucking best it, game, dude. Really? It's like, yeah. What were you doing How for about- work? Uh, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, if anybody needs an yeah. engineer, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. the yeah. boss come by, you're just playing fucking little league baseball. Yeah, <laughs> yeah dude, it was great. They, they, it's like that you had, <laughs> you had all the, you had New York. <laughs> Yeah. So you slept through school and played video games. Yeah. What what made you think also, you'd be a comic? <laughs> why was this game better with children? Oh, because the name RBI baseball was MLB. Ken Griffey was Dude, like, you're yeah. like, what about nine year olds? No. Yeah, it was just, it was just what slap hitters with gap power. <laughs> like, was, yeah. you weren't hitting dingers at all. Yeah. You're just oh, no, guys dude. Up. When you when you hit home runs, there were chicks with tits, dude. In the, <laughs> what? Do 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 do. I'll see you like twenty five playing. Do, 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 do. Is what sick. is this game? Yo, I remember playing it as a kid, dude. You smack one. Yeah. I remember my earliest memory of a great video game was Blades of Steel. <laughs> Remember oh, Blades of Steel yeah. on Nintendo? Yeah. And you could get into fights, and then uh, you could also play like Gallagher or something at the end of it. It was like, it was what, a the weird comic one. that smashes watermelon? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you could fucking you could play Gallagher. He's the final boss. Yeah. <laughs> final, the final boss. boss. <laughs> you gotta avoid getting splashed with watermelon <laughs> <laughs> and hacky one liners. <laughs> oh, man. I hope his fucking funeral was exciting. I heard it. Didn't Is he, he dead? He sold his set to his brother. His set. His brother was doing his set for like. Uh, yeah, what it was, was like it? his twin brother. I don't, I read it, so I didn't even read more into it. But I, I only remember, remember like the Marin interview a little bit. Yeah, where he like I don't know if you ever heard this, but like no. Gallagher sits down and is talking with Mark Marin, <laughs> and Mark's like trying to have a conversation with him about his like career and like how it's. Dude, that's an escape room for me. Those two talking at the same time. Dude, I would fucking, God. I would claw through the drywall. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's actually funny because Gallagher's like, I'm doing great. I'm like, I'm fucking, I'm playing county fairs and stuff like that. And Mark Maron's just like, who the fuck wants to play a county yeah. fair? And Gallagher like storms out. <laughs> oh, really? Dude, that yeah, yeah, yeah. That's awesome. It's, it's 20 minutes long because Gallagher awesome. spazzes and leaves. Dude, Gal- it is weird, like, <laughs> I'm 36. <laughs> dude, my earliest memories of... That, that is crazy. You and Bon Jovi? What's going dude, on, dude? Yo. 
Just smashing watermelon all over like a toothless lady with a fucking oh, mohawk. Right? Uh, Rex MD. This podcast is brought to you by Rex MD. That's a site where you can get pills if yeah. your dick doesn't work. Yeah. And uh, to, first of all, it's it's a very small percentage of the cost. Uh, uh, Viagra is like 90 bucks a pill. Yeah. If you talk to fucking Henry the neighbor... With Rex MD, it's like a couple bucks. Yes, it's cheap. Guys, You're saving money on the on the on the soft bird pills. Yes, and look, you don't have to go to the doctor and be like, my dick doesn't work, or my dick is softer than it normally is. Yeah, or biggest s- fear going to a lady doctor and being like, the my mechanism dick, is shut down. My dick is weird. Guys hate going to the doctor. It literally takes half a day just to get it done. That's the other thing. You got to go to do the thing. <laughs> also, you don't want to talk to your doctor about certain issues. Okay. And there's really a simple solution. You just get a pill and your dick's hard. Uh, And that's what we're about. At least Rex MD, that's what they're about. (laughs) Simple solutions. Rex MD makes getting generic and branded Viagra Cialis easy. Everything's online, even prescription, and they deliver to your door. No office visits, no talking to a receptionist. Super simple. This reminds me, I get my uh, contacts done. Here, you just put a computer up. You take a little eye test from a certain distance. You, I guess you could lie, but why would you lie? So you want to see perfect. Yeah, yeah. Just it gets get... delivered right here. Yeah. This is the same thing, but for broken birds. Yes, it's perfect. And they don't they do not do like their packaging is discreet. They don't have like a big broken bird package. Yeah, it's fast, simple, yeah. and cheap. And you can access your U.S. licensed Rex MD physician anytime you need afterwards. Here's what you do. You fill out a quick medical questionnaire on their website. A doctor will review your situation and prescribe you generic Viagra if appropriate. Okay? They got over 300,000 guys get generic Viagra quickly and conveniently. RexMD just works, and it works the very first night. Yes. Act now. Take advantage of their deal by heading to RexMD.com slash Stuff Island. Our exclusive deal will save up to 90% off where you'll pay as low as $2 per dose on generic Viagra instead of $90 plus on Viagra. Starter packs of generic Viagra or Cialis are now available for our listeners to get started, that's rexmd.com slash stuff island for up to 90% off plus a free gift. Your partner will thank you. She'll, she'll, him or her will enjoy a nice rock hard dick. It's 2023, man. You never Inside know who's getting the pipe. Yeah. <laughs> you want to be a hard factor than a rock. During the spring season, you need wholesome, convenient meals to energize for your warmer, more active days and keep you on track for reaching your goals. Factor, America's number one ready-to-eat meal kit, can help you fuel up fast with ready-to-eat meals delivered straight to your door with your dick pills. You'll save time, eat well, and tackle everything to your to-do list. Too busy to cook this, mate? (laughs) (laughs) With Factor, skip the trip to the grocery store and skip the chopping, prepping, cleaning up. Two... Factor's fresh, never frozen meals are ready in just two minutes. So all you have to do is heat and enjoy, then get back to outside and soak. They got 34 chef prepared, dietitian approved weekly options. There's always something new to try. Plus, you can round out your meal and replenish your snack supply with an assortment of 45 plus add ons, including breakfast items like our delicious apple cinnamon pancakes. Maybe cut back on that, you fatty. Bacon and <laughs> cheddar egg bites and potato bacon and egg breakfast skillet. Or for easy wellness boost, try refreshing beverage options like cold pressed juices, shakes, and smoothies. That's actually a nightmare, and that's that's something I would enjoy. Yeah, yeah. Dude, juicing into- the machine. I have the, my machine is like fifty fucking parts. Yes. Like I have, I have a like a, a metal toothbrush. I have to get old ginger out from six months ago. Yeah, yeah. It's I'm, I'm running out of breath like Foley. I want to get more into more cold pressed juices. And it's budgeting. Want to budget this month by cutting back on takeout? Get Factor instead. Not only Factor is cheaper than takeout, but meals are ready faster than restaurant delivery in just two minutes. With Factor, you can get rest assured you're making a sustainable choice. We offset 100% of our delivery emissions to your door, source 100% renewable electricity for our production sites and offices, and feature sustainably sourced seafood in our meals. Call. Let's go. Head to factormeals.com <laughs> slash Stuff Island 40 and use code Stuff Island 40 to get 40% off your first box. That's code Stuff Island 40 at factormeals.com slash Stuff Island 40 to get 40% off your first box. There you go. That's crazy. Factor. Get your meals, people. Dude, county fairs are, they're like, it's like a circus for humans. Yeah. Yeah. 
I mean, there's no. I like them for people watching, though. Yeah, yeah. of course, dude. Yeah. yeah, it's a boardwalk on grass. Yeah, I did the Texas State Fair one. I guess that's not a county fair. As no, much, that's, that's a like nice a one. good. One. Yeah, yeah, that's a. You nice go to the one. fucking Sooners Longhorns game. Yeah, you dude. get bombed. That's walk real, out, and you're yeah. at the fucking state fair. State fairs are fucking bang. So yeah, you're at county fairs. I don't know if I've been to a county, county fair, yeah, dude. It's like we used to go to the Big E Fair. What is that? It's just like fucking Western Massachusetts. The more I learn about you, the more I'm concerned. <laughs> yeah, dude, dude. I love watching people. Farmers, on. farmers from Massachusetts are the strangest fucking people. Yeah, the on boonies Earth. of Mass are weird. Huh? They are. What the what fuck is it? Western are you Mass, doing? I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All yeah. oh, once you go Western and then all the way to New Hampshire, they're all fucking strange dudes. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Dude, yeah. I did a fair in. Uh, it was like an Irish thing in Bethlehem, oh, Pennsylvania. PA? Dump. Crazy. I, dude, I wearing, dated a girl from there. It's yeah. a shithole. It yeah. was that was they bizarre. Have one, they yeah. have one like th- there's a nice casino out there, but they have like one strip of restaurants and s- things to do. Yeah, and people yeah. go nuts. Like it's so beautiful out there. Yeah, it's like dude, you got a fist fight it, it, just to get a, like a some eggs. It was a strange oh. fucking day. Yeah, my brain because well, all those kilts, <laughs> there was kilts and Eagles fans there. What? Just dudes in kilts and like eagles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm like, what's the dude's name? Yes, three. Dude. Remember that wide receiver three or whatever his name oh, was? Uh, oh, Javon Kurt or Javon. Uh, Could have been Javon Kurt. Do you say the freak? No, yeah. three. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I feel like I, I do remember. Yeah. Just a white. Threet. It was like a half white, half black dude that used to just be a slot guy. Yeah. I might be saying his name wrong, but either way, I just remember that vividly. That jersey. I'm like, dude, this guy. Is a strange yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> well, dude, all of that stuff, like all of those cities, are just like bombed out oil, old oil towns. Yeah, coal, yeah. steel, steel, yeah, yeah. coal. It's That's like steel. shutting steel. all the factories down. <laughs> dude, I've listened to Billy Joel. I know what's going on in rural PA. Dude, all those all, living dude, here in Allen. Dude, <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. All of those towns are literally like fucking. I drink your milkshake. Towns. Yeah, like Standard Oil straight up like sucked those places dry. Yeah. And That's stuck a, around, first, and then there's just huge. Movie. There's huge mansions where it used to be like old oil baron, like a whole just rich town, yeah. and it's bombed out. Now it's just meth heads in there, like fucking. Yeah, <laughs> that Mayton. is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sometimes. Yeah, Pennsylvania is funky. I mean, I'm from Cincinnati, and when you get out of the city, it's like. Yeah, this it's is fucking country, weird dude. shit. Pennsylvania. Yeah. PA feels a little fucking weird. It's most, fucking yeah. strange as hell, dude. Yeah, we're not. You go thirty Amish minutes west of the city, they got accents. Yeah, they have a drawl. And it's like, what do you, where the fuck? And they're wearing camo. They got Confederate license plates and, and shit. Then, then it melds into like West Virginia stuff on the yeah. south. It's right? like very, it's like, yeah. That's it's kind of like between like Cincinnati and Pittsburgh. It's is, funky. Yeah. yeah it's like Southern, like, uh, like what Eastern Ohio, yeah. that shit. And yeah. it's, I've never seen more claw games. Yeah. In like the, that that shitty claw game that you're guaranteed to lose. <laughs> oh, yeah, like, what yeah, the fuck? Yeah, claw yeah, game. Yeah. Like, <laughs> every rest stop, the claw game. Every <laughs> rest stop. Dude. The only way I could go to sleep as a child. <laughs> <laughs> we would drive around and look for claw games. <laughs> <laughs> Never seen more than rural PA. Time, I'm driving to West Virginia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I finally tinkered hey, out. Dude, best sleep I ever had. I'm telling you, every rest stop between Pittsburgh and Cincinnati <laughs> packed with claw yeah. games, oh, and it's just God. like. Somehow, These are the only morons still falling for this. <laughs> Somehow that area gave the world Joe Burrow, and we appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, yeah dude. oh yeah, thank dude. God. I feel Congrats like that is on a that. Thank thank that fucking thank rules. You. Dude. I'm, I'm like, no, thank you, <laughs> no, thank you guys. Dude. That's how I get, dude. Yeah, when people like they know you're a true fan, they're like, congrats, dude. Like, thank you so much. Dude. I am so appreciative. It's like I had a baby getting hurts on a, a contract. I'm like, thank you so much. I man. love. I got like I seven calls. Yours is cooler because you probably didn't know until like. This year that it was the guy. I thought it, I thought Jalen was the guy two years ago too. Like not to say I was early on it. You guys probably believe too. But like this year, I did. he still needed to prove himself. This year, Joey B. Like year two, he got injured year one. Then and I already believed. Yeah, like there yeah. was a Cleveland game where I was like. Pfft. What, dude? Also, the I don't bo- need to beat off the Tomb Raider dangling over <laughs> tires anymore. I got this guy. Yes, dude. The future is bright. And then year two was Super Bowl. Yeah, uh, obviously losing, but like he's the guy. Yeah, he's yeah. He is it's, the fucking dude, just man, having but it's that. So rare, you never expect it. To I never knew I could out. have this yeah. happiness. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's crazy. Yeah, he's he's gonna tear an ACL next year, I think. Well, now I'm sorry. No, this is. I'm. You know what? That I'll is fucking wrong. Gallagher. This Let's interview. See. <laughs> <laughs> Out of this bitch. Dude, dude, I slept. I slept on this fucking. We we watched Departed at four four a.m. Did you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's hilarious. Shane, Shane, uh, we came back hammered, and then Shane walked in hammered. I fell asleep. The yeah. door opened, then I hear these guys, and I came out like a fucking idiot. 
Jay I got a knot in my neck because I slept on this couch just watching the party for two straight hours. Yeah. I'm in Warner. pain. I shouldn't have said what I said to you, and I apologize. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 I take it back. Yeah, you it's both look like pain you both look like tertiary characters in the department. First of all, <laughs> dude, dude, <laughs> this is crazy. Yeah, different you look sides. like yeah, this is, yeah, yeah. You this look, is why we were watching. You look like you killed yeah. him in the department. <laughs> yeah, Shane was doing all the characters of each one. I was I was Baldwin. Dude. He was he was you Dame. would be Baldwin. Yeah, yeah. no, Dame I think you're I think you're a thug. I think you're like. Fourth guy. In I don't know, dude. Behind. You gotta watch. You gotta yeah, see. That's true. You also you gotta, gotta know see me. Being cop, yeah. Just sweaty, being like, you want to smoke? You want a cigarette? Oh, what are you? One of those fucking fitness oh, freaks? Yeah. Go fuck yourself. I love that line, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Who are you? Yeah, I, I'm the guy that does the job. You must be the other guy. Yeah. Oh no, that's Wahlberg. But yeah, still. yeah. No, he's Great. got Wahlberg too. <laughs> yeah. It was yeah. the morph. It was the morph. <laughs> are you Marty Sheen also yeah. somehow? <laughs> <laughs> Good lord! And then who are you? You're the, you're the dude that spells the Damon. fucking citizens I was Matt wrong. Damon. I was... he's, the, he's the idiot that spells citizens wrong, but somehow every <laughs> hockey player correctly. Let him be Khabibi, and he's got it right. <laughs> <clears throat> oh man, that's a fantastic movie. Yeah, it's so good. How do you like LA from being from Cincinnati? I fucking love it. I here, here's what. I decided after, and then I'm, I've been in Arizona. I was in Arizona for like 15 years too. So I went like 18 to like I don't know what I was 33 when I moved. Now I've been in LA for three years. I'm out on seasons for sure. Yeah. Uh, fuck. You don't you know, like miss me with fall and like winter. What? What? Yeah, yeah I don't like that shit at all anymore. So no. I'm not, yeah. Give me 75 sunny. I get what it. What the fuck are we doing? Like I'm buying chapstick a lot. I it's fucking dude. you're taking long showers just to clear up some shit. Just I got to feel good to go. <laughs> I hate yeah. that. Yeah. Also, you, yeah. Cincinnati winners got to be. They're they're mild but grimy. See, they're like that's annoying. The worst. That's yeah. the worst. So I get like sinuses. Uh, it was in a fucking river valley, all that shit. So I'd get yeah. like fucked up. LA is great. Yeah. It's, it's, it's 75 right now. Um, I would say also like if you're doing cool shit in LA, LA is one of the coolest fucking places. Yeah. yeah. And I'm fortunate enough to be doing some pretty dope shit out there. I'm, so that's cool. Yeah. I'm a big, I'm a big fan of LA. I like every time I'm out there, I'm like, I can, I'm going tomorrow. I and it. I think, oh, really? I buy, by Saturday, I'll be like, yeah, yeah, get me the fuck out of here. Some people are too East Coast for it. Yeah. Yeah. I can't do it. Yeah. It's I love definitely this. Different. I also love the I seasons. I don't know. I, you do. I do. I hate the cold, obviously the extreme cold, but yeah. I love the change. Yeah. You look like a guy who's got six, eight jackets. Yeah. Like oh, that. maybe. I like, the ch- I like the change. <laughs> Open the glass. And look yeah. at my collection. <laughs> Is that real? <laughs> There's crazy. only one Japanese jacket I can't wear. <laughs> <laughs> Just doesn't fit right. <laughs> yeah. I'm too old for these shapes. Yeah, right? That's hilarious. But winners like this... That was nothing. Fuck. That I heard it was win- nothing. It was yeah, nothing. It's bullshit. It's yeah. gimme snow. If I want snow. snow. snow was wild, LA, kind of chilly in January. Yeah. We were all talking like, this really? is the coldest it's ever been. Yeah. Really? What, what 65? Was it, like? it, was, it was like, at, the, at night, it'd be like 45, something like that. Yeah. But you're like, fuck this. No, yeah. that's nice. <laughs> I agree. I actually like... I like wearing clothes, dude. I like being cold at night, too. Yes. I like, I sleep yes. way, way better in the cold. Yeah. This right um, now is pissing me off, this weather. What is this? Because like, it broke. Every fucking year, it breaks. It gets to like 70. Yeah. And everybody gets gets excited. It got and 90. And then, it was like 86. Yeah, it was 86 yeah. or something. Yeah. For three, four days in a row. And then it goes right back to 40, 40 50. Yeah, yeah, It's yeah. like 51 right now. Cloudy shit. Drives me yeah. fucking insane. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I start fighting strangers. And sure. saying shit, like I said to you, I, I shouldn't have said. Hey, he's going to tear his fucking ACL. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> I shouldn't have said I that. Think I think Aaron Rodgers. He already did that. I love it. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> it's like, I'm bitten PTSD on this shit. Fucking, ugh. They're also both of them, Jalen and, and Burrow. Like they're so they're fucking. I, they're hot. They're yeah. smooth. Yeah, I like the way they handle themselves. They're smart and collected. Dude, their post game conferences <sighs> are just smoke shows. They're dude. hitting a thousand. It's crazy. Whereas like I like, dude, I get the Mahomes thing. First of all, his little brother just got it <laughs> accused of aggravated sexual of assault. Course. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. I don't even know if Joe Burrow has siblings, but they ain't doing that. Yeah, I thought he was gay. Uh. Uh, he is. Uh, yeah, and it was a yeah. chick that he. Yeah, yeah. I know. It's well, he is. Tits. Yeah. No, it was like a. He's, he's look. He's a fucking privileged kid who's unchecked his whole life for the most part under yeah. the shadow of his older brother. Yeah. So he's doing this shit all the time, and finally, one person was like, he wasn't sexually. I don't think he actually got in trouble for that, right? Oh no, literally, he, got he just got accused. I'm telling oh, really? you, he's in jail right now, and there's a hundred thousand no. dollar bail. No. Yeah, just way. it was on the way over. I was on the on the end train. Got that yeah. information. <laughs> so oh he fucking God. yeah. He basically just grabbed. Didn't sure he grabbed the fine. ass of there's a, a video manager at there a bar. Was definitely a grope, and he did go for a kiss. And I think she did the like whatever thing, or maybe they kissed. I don't know. But also, it's like yeah, 
What now you're bisexual? Pick a side, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, it's dude. just three straight white dudes. And that's what I'm angry about. I think it's just hey, pri- stay away from these bras. It's just privilege at this point. It's yeah. like the kid doesn't he you know he doesn't have a job, I guess. Well, I imagine he should no, be, he should be fucking in the NBA, dude. He's it, huge. He's too tall to be dancing he's on those videos. Huge. He, dude, he's like I he's love built that. like I love Anthony this. Davis. It's like you just see somebody tall, you're like, you, are you in the NBA? Yeah. It's like, what? Dude? Well, I mean, this isn't just Half some black, guy. It's that like, tall? it's you Mahomes' got, brother. Yeah, yeah. It, it, but it doesn't work like that. You don't just have the gene. No. I know, but. I got a, I got a brother fucking. I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, come I, on. <laughs> the, the head down. Uh, uh, I know. Dude, instead of making TikToks. No, I, got no, my I oldest... fucking hate that guy. I don't. I went to, uh, <laughs> I went to Kansas City for the Bengals Chiefs. AFC Championship, tough. Yeah, that's a tough um, one. Tough yeah. to see. I was there for the Super Bowl too, so I've seen two pretty tough. Outs. Ah, dude. But I've also seen some wins too. Like I saw, I was at the. What was the other one? I saw? I've seen some good shit. So, but yeah, just the fact brutal. that you guys are in these games is it's fucking pretty dope. fucking incredible. It's dude. fucking dope. And then it's also. Did you do the Icky Shuffle growing up? I'll do the Icky let's, Shuffle right let's now. Fucking go. You know what I'm saying? I'll fucking it. I did let's it. Go. I did it yesterday. I love. <laughs> I, love I love that I dude. Just, I had a nervous, a nervous <coughs> tick. I got. It's Plus, a great. It's so easy. Anybody can do it. Dude, they used to. They people. You ever hear the term? Uh, she's a Cincinnati Bengal. No. Uh, mm. Great uniform, awful helmet. Oh. Saying like she's got a great yeah, body, yeah, terrible yeah. face. That's a good. I didn't like that analogy. Wait, no, the helmets are great. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Yeah, flip. yeah. They used to say Cincinnati Bengal all the time for like a, a butterface. Who in that's, Philly? I like the I don't helmet know better than the uniform. Me too. I, yeah, yeah, I actually think that we have the best helmets in football. They're up like, there for across, sure. I think there's yeah. some college stuff that is better. Yeah, yeah. but like, dude, the Bengal Tiger, dude, fucking so sick. <sighs> your unis are so sick. It's so dope. And they, yeah. they update it, right? What's the your, new? Uh, the new unis are better. The old ones are pretty like regular, like the Chad Johnson Carson yeah, Palmer yeah. era was yeah. like kind of whatever. Yeah, we just switched them up. They're clean. Yeah, they're nice. Like, Eagles are back to Kelly Green this year, baby. D- oh, is that a yeah, switch? That's right. Fucking huge. Yeah. What were you guys like? Dark green. Yeah, like a darker, like dark green. Shit green. Some shit, yeah, the fans had enough. Yeah, yeah, that green. We've been barking. I for love Kelly. that Randall Cunningham helmet. Was that's like Kelly. my shit. That's yeah. Kelly. That was like yeah, the old school. It's so funny when the gray, the gray, face mask, the gray bird. You just accept this. You're like, this is great, and then somebody in the yes. fucking communications department is like, nah, we got to switch it. What, dude? You know dude, what that is? That's like somebody wanting to put a fingerprint on something that has. They just want. To say, it's like that. It's like that dumb bitch that doesn't shut up at the end of a conference call. She just wants to say yeah. something. She's to piggyback on what Charlie said <laughs> and just circle back on Steve's yes, point. Dude, it's, it's like, like you're actually not saying anything. <laughs> you're saying what we all said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck shut up. Shut the fuck yeah. up. I yeah. want to get out. Yeah, get off, get off the phone. Yeah, yeah. get off the phone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's the same thing. It's just some rich Jewish kid who's the son of an owner. Yeah. who's like, I want to put my fingerprint on this. Like, we you're should right. change the color of or the a new uniforms. owner or something like that. Yeah. Um, no, yeah. I, I'm sticking with Jewish kid. No, it's a Jew. Okay. <laughs> um, meanwhile, the only team that should definitely change it up is like the Browns. They're like, we're staying. This Dog, is yeah, it. yeah. There's that, a girl we were just talking about on Twitter. It's like, I always oh, see yeah, her. Redoing re- logos. Re- yeah, yeah, redesigning you logos. Know what? There's some that are all right. She did yes. a Lions one that was yes. cool. Yes. I think that was Lions the one that went viral. Yeah, Lions yeah. is great. Lions is sick, but the, the Lions, Vikings one was good. I didn't see Vikings. And the dog and the uh, Cleveland. Yeah. She made one for, the, like, for the Browns. Yes, and it was better because it's just like... Something. Yeah, it's a brown <laughs> yeah. helmet. The yeah. logo is a picture of the brown helmet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What are we doing? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what the fuck's going on, dude? <laughs> like, rebrand. Yeah. It's, yeah. And there is a thing. I think it's just like the, the early 2000s were just a tough time for jerseys. And uniforms. <laughs> I thought we were going Bush administration. I didn't know what we were doing <laughs> in the early 2000s. What happened to those buildings? Uh, yeah, 9 yeah, 11. Yeah, yeah. New York redesigned. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Bush saw two buildings. He said, let's knock that down, put one up, put a mall on the bottom of that bitch. Uh, it was a tough least, time for yeah. Jersey. Yeah, dude, Jersey. It was. <laughs> it was. Never forget. First yeah. term Bush. I mean, remember what the jerseys are going through? Little Wayne's on the come up. Dude, Just dude. talking about money. Uh, finish crazy. the sentence. <laughs> <laughs> We're tough for one. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Dude. Nobody in their right mind was like, NFL, NFL jerseys. jerseys. <laughs> I, I know. We're so consumed the, with the not war. The economy. And, yeah, yeah. The youth dying yeah. in the Middle uh, Middle East. Yeah. No, yeah. Yeah. no, no. no I had no. some close yeah. friends dying over that. No, but jerseys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was had Our government took down close. two buildings just to. Yeah. <laughs> to yeah. Oh, no, that was three. Building seven, seven can... did go down yeah. also. That's oh. that missile that hit the Pentagon. God damn. Um, <laughs> <laughs> tough time. Tough time. Tough time for 
Oh, man, <laughs> when do you go back beautiful. to LA? Uh, I'm here till like the 11th. So I'm here for like, I, I always come out and do like a week or two yeah. just to fucking do the New York shit. Nice. Yeah. Um, and then I'm going to go, actually, uh, my homie Pete Lee just hit me up. I'm going to go f- feature for him at Syracuse Funny Bone. Oh, fun. Thomas said hello. Yeah, Pete's the man. Dude. He's the man. He's the Syracuse. fucking sweet, sweet and boy. Dude, and he is a good, uh, he's a great comic to work with on a weekend because, dude, he'll just be sipping McAllen's yeah. like it's water. Yeah. And, yeah. It's, and he stays. He's actually a very impressive drinker, Wisconsin. But it's yeah. nice to have a guy that can, you can drink with because I'm out in L.A. Dude, I don't know how New York is. Everybody's fucking sober. Yeah. I'm the weirdo at the comedy store crushing Maybe. 805s or something. Yeah, dude. And it's like, dude, nobody's with me. Like, it was nice seeing you that one time we were getting after uh, yeah, it a little yeah. bit. Oh, dude. Well, it was like, what is that, a festival or some shit? I forget. Netflix, uh, right? Oh, yeah. Wasn't yeah, that where yeah, you were yeah, there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, at the comedy store? Yeah, well, that were one night, yeah, up? that was at the store. Well, it was like a party at the store. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah, how yeah, fucked yeah, up yeah. we were. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> we we play out. baseball again? <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're playing Little League Baseball back in my spot on the computer. <laughs> we the tents, out. the tents. <laughs> we got fucked up with the Are You Garbage guys yesterday. Went out. We were drinking with... You could light my Kev- breath right now. Yeah, dude. Really? Kev- we went out late night. Kevin Ryan, we were fucking shit-faced. Kevin Ryan bet me a thousand dollars. I couldn't learn. Oh the my Charleston. god, I forgot about this. Yeah, yeah. What learn, learn what? The, the Charleston. Charleston. Oh, that's, by, a, that's a tough one. <laughs> <laughs> is, is it? I don't. Oh, you <laughs> still haven't done it? <laughs> no, I've okay, done it. no further research uh, on this. Yeah. I don't know. I've seen some videos where I'm like. These black gentlemen in the 30s dude, and 40s dude, were really dude. putting it down. I got till August to figure out it's the, the Charleston. And then you got to kick yeah, your leg yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> the arms is, thing, too. I'm dude, in on that. Dude, he, he tried to bet. Oh, yeah, the arms gonna, thing. The bet, yeah. the bet originated with me. And he was yeah. like, I'll bet you. He said like 500 bucks. I was like, I'm not doing You're gonna. He's like, but I have to film it and we can post it. And I was like, it's got to go up. You got to go up to like 15. Yeah, and then Chris comes. Chris comes barreling in and goes, "Make it three. We'll do it together." And I was like, "No, no, no, <laughs> back out, dude!" Coordinating no. that dance because because <laughs> yeah. once he realized what was this going is on, not how it went down. A hundred percent. And I was like, "Dude, no," because it, he's asking for coordination, meaning we're ha- we'll have to do it to right. get paid. Synced we have up. to do it synchronized. S- synchronized. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I was like, "There's no fucking way, dude. No, we'd have to practice together. I can't live with that no. fucking shame." Yeah. This How do you think it went? This is what actually happened. <laughs> I love you when the about- story starts with, we started drinking at four. <laughs> yeah, dude. I'll tell you the story. So, the what fact actually is, happened nobody is Tommy, knows how it happened. Tommy, Tommy was about to make the deal for the 500 bucks. Okay. Okay. And I was like, no, we both do it. Three thousand. <laughs> what a right? large what jump. Happened. Yes. That is what happened. That's not what happened. And Kevin Ryan was like, Yes. And then Tommy was like, No. <laughs> and then I was like, Well, I'll do it by myself. <laughs> For th- for fifteen hundred, he was like a thousand, and then Tommy was like, "You stole my bet," <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, "I'm I the one who got the price." Up. Yeah. yeah. So uh, Chris basically, I was fun. at fifteen hundred. Chris came in and was like, "I'll do it for a thousand. No, yeah, there's the summary. No, no, he was at five. No, he was at five. No, I was. I got it up to. I got it up to fifteen. I got the price. I got the bet of five to three k. Yes. And then you settled on a gur. For you solo. Here's what's gonna happen. Nothing. You're going to lose. He's not going to do it. Yeah. I'm definitely going to do You're it. You're not going to do it. <laughs> Where are you going to... How's yeah, the spacing in no, your apartment dude, to dude, learn this? Look there's at, no shot at you doing this. This is you? This is you? That coffee table is not going back till August. <laughs> <laughs> I know. This is what I'm imagining. You, you're walking out. You're trying to walk through the party. Dude, rolling in here doing the Charleston. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, dude, succession season finale's on. <laughs> Give me ten. <laughs> the big dance is in a week. Exactly. <laughs> don't fuck with that song. What uh, is the song? Is it a specific song you have to do it to? I, I no, no there's I don't, just shit. anything from yeah. that era. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's amazing. Yeah. yeah, and it's gonna be on the internet forever. So I was like, I, I, well, that's I'm good. Good. It's good you guys get drunk enough to make poor bets. No, yeah. I had. We're, like we're going. Like to, that's we're why going that was down. the story to yeah. say, look, we drink too. We can hang. I've been known. We can hang. You know how much we can hang? We made the worst bet in the world last night. <laughs> <laughs> really? We just oh. lost a G. Oh, oh, oh you think you got a drinking problem? <laughs> how much do well, I, I drink? How much you want to bet that I got a bigger drinking problem than you? <laughs> <laughs> I got to learn the Charles to be honest. Dude, that's so funny. A, how much do you drink? Yeah. How much? I gotta live in Charleston <laughs> by August, all right? <laughs> by Labor Day. You think I. Uh, yeah. Good oh, lord. You, you tend to hit the horn yourself. Oh my god. 
<laughs> you ever bet your brain right. you have to learn to dance? Like I just eat a lot of fried food is what I was gonna say. I just yeah. have an eating problem. How's my life going? <laughs> <laughs> and he does it. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I'm a darling. I love my baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think you drink? And that's <laughs> this is you, the, the future of you. Just, I know the Charleston. Also, that'd be so great if, like, if you set that up. Oh shit! <laughs> like you set that up, like you really wanted to learn the Charleston. Yeah, so you oh, had yeah. to like fire it up, like, well, I'll give me a bet. I bet you I'll learn a Charleston. You he calls his mom. Way. He's like. You got a Christmas present coming your way. We're, you learn it, I learn it, and we'll sync it up. Oh, dude. Oh. Like, you got a big wedding coming up, so you need like you need to really impress somebody. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Charleston Chris is what they're going to call you, because it's the only dance you're going to oh, do at dude. weddings, dude. That's going to be so sick. That's the other thing. I fucking bought my parents tickets to Ireland last night. <laughs> what? Yeah. Yeah. This is, dude, this is actually an intervention. <laughs> dude, I got drunk. What? Yeah, I bought, I bought both my parents' flights to Dublin. In <laughs> Did you use the stuff on the card or your card? This better be a celebratory trip, dude. Uh, I gotta cancel those tickets. You, so you got twenty. You got twenty four hours. Yeah. yeah. You do. Yeah. Yeah. Once, yeah. Whenever you buy a flight, you can cancel it <coughs> for. Yeah, you jump on that <laughs> if they're watching. You oh, ain't going to shit. Dublin, sweetheart. Why? Why? Uh, you just feel emotional? No, because we're going out to Ireland to oh, yeah. do those shows. Yeah, and I was like, they should come. I mean, maybe stick with it. Yeah, you're gonna be up a G here shortly. You're gonna be learn the Charles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like. <laughs> He actually bought it I'm to incentivize that money himself. Already. I'm He's like, that now money. I gotta learn the Charleston. <laughs> I'm out of G on these double tickets. <laughs> oh. All right, guys. Let's take a moment to thank my favorite sponsor of all the sponsors, Sheath Underwear. Sheath makes the most comfortable box of briefs I've ever worn in my life. I do not wear anything else. Every time you see me, hear my voice. Every time you see my face, just know that I'm <laughs> a wonderful, comfortable pair once. of Sheath what boxer are you briefs. Nah, my old fucking <laughs> shit. Look at this. What? Oh, you got sheath in there? Yeah, baby. Nice. That's how I purpose. had sheath on yesterday. I save my sheath boxers for when I'm uh, with a lady. Oh, because they're fancy. Yeah. Do you have the uh, leopard print ones? I do. They're the, uh, the camo? Yeah, they're camo. The it's like, yeah, yeah it's yeah. like a leopard fuck the camo. Desert trip. camo. Yes, yeah. Yeah. I do. It <laughs> makes me feel like an assassin. <laughs> In the puss. You murder that pussy. Eh? Yeah. Mostly I just strip them off in the dark and then jack. Uh, pussy. Clear. Stretchy fabric is made out of a moisture wicking technology. They are super soft and they keep everything cool and comfortable and in the right place. Dude, I will say that if you're going on a date and you got a little anal leakage because you oh, got your fucking God, uh, you stop with this. hemorrhoid adjusted, <laughs> put your balls and dick in the bag. <laughs> It'll keep the poop off them. Sheath is particularly useful for staying cool. Yeah, okay. I used to be a guy who just went and bought a six-pack of Hanes underwear. Didn't think about it at all until Sheath sent me a pair of their underwear. I put it on, and I was like, I can never go back. I particularly love the dual pouches. They keep your man parts separated, especially if you got a leaky butt. And it is a game changer. If you're a little skeptical, as I was, I was not. I believed in them right off the jump. <laughs> I'd say give it a try, but even if you don't want to use the dual pouches, you don't have to. You can just wear them like a regular pair of boxer briefs. If you haven't gotten your hemorrhoids adjusted and you don't have anal leakage, you can just wear them regular. And your balls and dick will stay nice and cool as a cucumber. Uh, they also have materials like bamboo and mesh for even more cooling comfort. They have bamboo shirts, hoodies for wintertime, everything. Go to sheathunderwear.com and get the most comfortable underwear you'll ever wear. And if you use promo code Stuff Island, you will also get 20% off your entire order. That's sheathunderwear.com, promo code Stuff Island for 20% off your entire order. Yeah, listen. If you're dehydrated from talking about how you're wearing bamboo underwear, try Liquid IV. Can you imagine wearing bamboo under underwear? I bet it's great. It probably is. Yeah, I bet it's good. Yeah, but you know the type of person who wear bamboo underwear and without letting you know they're wearing yeah, bamboo yeah, underwear? Yeah. yeah. Brooklyn. Yeah, it's That's true. a Williamsburg But attitude. I like my balls being like a little panda bear looking through the... Yeah? Yeah. Just rolling around? Yeah, yeah. Playing? My dick, my dick in there just eating. It's, the panda bear has to be like between the ages of one and three for... Panda bears suck. What? Yeah. Dude. 
domesticated panda bear, maybe the cutest thing in the world. I mean, but until they, they just, get like six, yeah, and start tackling your fridge. Panda bears, they don't make sense. They, no, they should don't. be extinct. Well, they have the social. They, they hate fucking. They don't eat. They can't even digest bamboo. Yeah. They they just eat bamboo all day and they're all sleepy because they they just got no eat nutrients. It. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. terrible. Yeah, it's like a they're, koala. They're a disaster. Munching through those fucking leaves that have nothing. Yeah, it's like your fat shit. The Pick only, a different food. Yeah, There's yeah. so many options. Yeah, get but out of the won't tree. Leave the bamboo forest. Take a walk. They like Asia. Yeah, it's like Eskimos acting like it. That like it's only one place to live on the fucking earth. Yeah, and then they get all sad. It's yeah, true. stop Eskimos, chopping through three yeah. feet of ice for a piece of fish that's not going to feed one of your fat kids. Yeah, why did Eskimos stay up there? They're all meat wagons too. They're built like seals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they're just eating blubber from dawn till dusk. Yeah, one stick of liquid ID IV and sixteen ounces of water hydrates you. Two times faster and more efficiently than water alone. 12 delicious, refreshing flavors to keep your hydration routine exciting. You don't get used to the same. Abuse. Contains five essential vitamins B3, B5, B6, B12, and vitamin C. With three times the electrolytes of traditional sports drinks like Gatorade, you, you, you sugary Too bitch. much sugar, yeah. Make the premium ingredients. Made with premium ingredients, non GMO, and free from gluten, dairy, and soy. Liquid IV believes that. Equitable access to clean and abundant water is the foundation of a healthier world. That's why they're partnering with leading organizations for innovative solutions to help communities protect both their water and their futures. To date, Liquid IV has donated over 39 million servings in 50 plus countries around the world. They should make a Liquid IV well in like East Africa, like a Gatorade well. That would fucking yeah, that why would be don't, so sick, dude. Yeah, why don't they do that? These kids, kids walking buckets of feces. You come across a fucking fruit punch Gatorade well. Oh, you know, I used to, I used to hear that they would drink a lot of Coca Cola because no, the sugar and well, it was also just like it was the only clean water. Oh, it was like the only clean drink they didn't. Get. Dasani get caught for like making hose water and putting yeah, in bottles and is, shit. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's they Coca Cola. They're owned by Coca Cola. The whole water, the whole water bottle thing is yeah, a giant it's fake fraud. Yeah. Grab your Liquid IV in bulk nationwide at Costco, or you can get 20% off when you go to liquidiv.com and use code STUFFISLAND at any checkout. That's 20% off anything to you order when you shop Better Hydration today using promo code STUFFISLAND at liquidiv.com. You get 20% off. All right. Displate. If your home is still sporting Polaroids on the walls of you and your friends from college, it's time for an upgrade. Make the swap to Displate, the art Dumper. of the future. High quality metal prints with millions of cool designs. Uh, Displate sells awesome metal posters that are easy to hang and switch out whenever you are ready for a change. If you're a gamer, grab some art from Doom. You remember Doom? Yeah, I remember Doom. I played Doom 2. Oh, Doom. Not Dune, Dune? 2. no. Dune Two is coming out. The movie Dune, Dune. Two is. is Remember how good Dune out. was? Yeah, I loved Dune. A lot of people hated Dune. I saw people talking shit about Dune, but Doom. I like Dune. Is good. Beautiful. World of Warcraft also a good game. Or movies are more your thing. Check out Star Wars and Peaky Blinders posters. Can we? We can upload any image. I don't know. But they got a lot of stuff on there. You know, I like. I little, think you can upload your I own like image the frog and make your own art. A pipe under a mushroom. Uh, That's what I like. I know. I saw that. It's on the homepage. Click the link in our description to see some of our favorites and get your ready to hang piece of art. Save twenty two percent if you buy one or two. We got to get a Burton Ernie display. Yeah, that would be nice. Yeah, if we could send. Yeah. Send our little logo there. We'll upload it, yeah. Get 33% off when you buy three or more. The discount will be automatically applied to your cart when you click our link. Use code STUFFISLAND when you visit displate.com to get the discount. That's displate.com, code STUFFISLAND. Or click the link in our show notes. All right? Upgrade your posters. <laughs> oh, Damn, shit. Dude. So you're going to tell them? That you canceled? <laughs> Did you already tell him you bought them? No. Oh, I was just surprised. I was going to surprise my mom for her birthday. That is cute. You should, I, keep, you should keep, keep them. Keep it. That's wonderful. That's great. Are yeah. they, they're both Irish? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm assuming. Has she ever been? Uh, Yeah, once. Yeah, once. we should definitely Back keep Back in 06. I've heard it's beautiful. It's great. I've never I don't know what time of year it We're is. Going and we have family but, over there and stuff. Still? So. Really? Yeah, yeah. Nice. My, my grandfather's buried there. I got so my I'm on a hill my, overlooking Shannon Bay. Really? Yeah. 
It's you could have said anything out of believe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it sounds like downtown Boston, buddy. Yeah. Um, that's where I'm filming. Like, sure? That's where you're filming. Over your grandfather's <laughs> grave. He's doing the Charleston. That's just a line in the departed. <laughs> yeah, you just He's buried on a hill. <laughs> I tell you to dump a body in the marsh. You dump a fucking body in the marsh. <laughs> Mom, tell um, my dad. Oh my I'm not coming home for a solver. Did you get your period yet? <laughs> I used to quote that fucking movie all the fucking time. It's so good. I uh, well, that'll be good. I got my mother's. Uh, my mother's maiden name is Moody, so she's Irish as fuck. Yeah, yeah. They got a good like origin story. The, uh, they just came over late 1800s, fucking Brooklyn, opened a bar, Irish. That's what we've been doing. Really? You know I mean, yeah, it's a you good nice one. Like, there's a, I can go to the address. It's like a fucking high rise now or something. But what, in Ireland or? No, in, the, in Brooklyn, they opened oh, a bar. Okay. And then my uncle, Jack, he did all the research. Like, we don't have a 23andMe because he did like the whole fucking, he retired from being a, a public school teacher up in Rochester. And he's like, I'm going to map this shit out. And so now we can go back to Ireland. He knows like where they were married, no back shit. to like pretty far back. Yeah. And like, he got, we got like a couple people buried over there yeah dude it's 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 cool to know some shit yeah but then uh, yeah but also like thank god jack did it i, I don't think, really give a fuck I think dude, my, my family did the same thing my my uncle uh uncle charlie there's there's a charlie papa park in upper darby he was like a politician oh really and he had money money for back then and they there's no 23 me so he had to pay like whatever like twenty thousand dollars to to pay like these people to go to Ellis research. Island and like yeah, map yeah. out like where who came in where and then they go and they found out my Italian grandmother they surprised her this was like a gift for her yeah and she had a wooden leg which is hilarious it's amazing can't so do the Charleston the, the, can't not can't do not the Charleston, Charleston. <laughs> so they bring, she's first generation they bring her this uh, this like where exactly their their lineage is from yeah. in Italy and all like the families around and Uncle Charlie apparently this is my father says this. Gave it to her, and she opens it up, and it turns out that she's Austrian. Oh, no. Whoa. And she rips it up. And somebody fucked a black guy at some point. <laughs> she has a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> and walks out. She ripped, she it, up ripped it up. Really? She couldn't believe, yeah, and refused to believe she was Austrian instead of Italian. I'm with that, too, yeah. Yeah. So I think I'm Austrian instead of Italian. That's crazy. <laughs> I mean, there's, yeah. there's definitely, you know. Those, I mean, those monkeys. We're all, we're all yeah. mutts. Yeah yeah yeah, 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 yeah. It's like I'm not. Out, I'm fucking probably yeah, barely Irish at this point. Yeah, I just know yeah. my mother's maiden name is Moody, so I'll roll with that. I'm not yeah, looking yeah. it up. No, who cares? My uncle Jack looked it all up too. It's like when you really look back, you realize some sad shit. I remember t- we were. It was like two Christmases ago. We were all together, and I'm asking him a bunch of shit. Like he's got stories now and shit. And then he tells me all these stories, and at the end, I'm like, "So we were all we have nothing that is cool in our whole family. We're just yeah. a bunch of pieces of shit that yeah, have been drinking so for like 300 years. Yes, yes. so is everyone. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's like pathetic shit. Oh okay. yeah, one guy started a union. Yeah, I don't know. I don't yeah, know yeah. enough yeah, about you, unions yeah, to know yeah, if I'm yeah, pro yeah, union yeah, or not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like uh, <laughs> nobody joined. <laughs> but, no, no, it was a good <laughs> thing. But the like that was it. One guy fucking uh, almost got arrested. He ended up like. They think they threw him off a boat. They don't know what the fuck happened to him. They either died because the he owed the money mob or the mob money. Yeah, shit like that. That was a cool story. I was like, oh, so he was a piece of shit that stole money from the mob of and they course. threw him off a boat. <laughs> yeah. We don't know what Pretty happened. Sick. Kind yeah. Of, yeah, yeah. Departed. We well, already said union. That's just you <laughs> no, know exactly what happened. They started the union in lieu of a yeah. Yeah, it was bad. Uh, yeah. Union yeah. served bad people. Yeah, exactly. I've never, I've never understood. Mobs though could yeah. be just an yeah. Italian yeah. Irish. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mobs are. Yeah, I mean, mobs what, are good. Look what yeah. the writers are doing. They're fucking doing nothing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. the mob is good, dude. The mob is good. It, Greed is good. It, it, well, it was good. <laughs> this is where that guys are political. Let's no, stick no, to no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get back to jerking kids off. <laughs> yeah, exactly. No, dude. No I remember circumcisions. We were we were watching like uh, we were watching. I remember Shane and I years ago. We were watching some like documentary about like dudes in India working just yeah. in like some fabric. They were just making fabric or something. Sure. I don't know. And uh, the working conditions are obviously like fucking terrible, and right. they're just like. There getting shit on, and uh, the with the person making the documentary asked one of the person like uh, like one of the people like what do you guys ever think about like organizing or like right. unionizing trying to get some rights or something? They're like yeah yeah well, like we do that, and then like the powers that be are always like all right who's like representing you? And they're like this guy, and then that guy's dies. That guy's dead in yeah. a second. Yeah. Yeah. Like, all right, back to work. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Let's get back to it. And, and I'm just sitting there, just being like they should make a mob. Yeah, that's how you do it. 
you yeah. make organized crime sure. so that the rich guy is like, I'm going to kill your union guy. And sure. the mob's like, I don't think that you are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a nice family you got going. Yeah. <laughs> Shame if something happened to it. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like, that's the only way you get it, you know. Damn, an Indian mob movie would fucking rule. Yeah. They're probably going crazy over there with the mob. The Chinese mob Chinese movies mob are great. Those dudes. Those are good. The yeah. Chinese Those mob movies are, are Japanese. Those dudes are nuts. Chinese. Mo- yeah, Chinese yeah. mobs. Yeah, yeah. Chinese yeah. mobs are right? nasty, dude. Yeah. It, that's Philly's where the, got a, dude, that's what a the, big one. The Departed is based on a movie that was a Chinese mob movie. Really? Oh, yeah? Do you know that? No. Yeah. yeah. He like literally just took the script and made it American. Yeah, they're all the same. It. Every Boston yeah. movie's the same. Yeah. So it, they literally, yeah, they just made it about Boston, yeah. but it's actually a dope ass, <laughs> like it was a great, hugely popular yeah. Dude, uh, AI generated dude, those, Boston movie. It would be a fucking banger. They're, they <laughs> Ready Player One, all the but great, in Southie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just all the great scenes from like four movies. Yeah. It'd be fucking easy oh, to do. dude. I, uh... Fire I, that up, AI. I mean, how many, how many Boston movies are made? Dude, The Town is fucking the great. The Town's great. Uh, Goodwill Hunting is Goodwill amazing. Goodwill Hunting is fucking Hunting's unbelievable. Good. The Departed is great. Uh, uh, yeah, Boondock Saints. Boondock Saints. <laughs> Boondock Saints yeah, is great. Yeah. Uh, Sequel, not so much. Um, dude, do you ever see no. the making of Boondock Saints? It's so no. bad. It's incredible, it? dude. Really? Because the guy who wrote the script was just some drunk asshole yeah. from Boston, uh, right? Yeah. And so he wrote this script. Oh, yes, I did see this. Yes. And and then, like, it became, like, the script in Hollywood. Where <laughs> it was like the blacklist? Like, everyone, no, everyone wanted it. Right? Really? Yeah. And they're, like, like Harvey Weinstein, all these people were, like, paying tons of money just to, like, have access. Nice name drop. Just what a great. good choice name <laughs> dude, drop. Right. He was well, thinking, I mean, the, yeah. the one we know, though. He yeah. was fresh off of Goodwill Hunting. Oh, he, was yeah. he was probably yeah, touching. Yeah, dude. I was watching Goodwill Hunting recently. I'm like, dude, Mini Driver blew Harvey Weinstein. Oh, 100. She fell off. What did she do after Goodwill Hunting? She gave him know. a handy, and he said, "Your career's oh, over." Right? That yeah. fucking mutant. Imagine him naked, dude. I think about it all the time. Oh my god. Yeah, it's tough. He's, He's in, disgusting. He was staying in Scottsdale, Arizona, for a long time during the the trial. You'd get eyes on them sometimes. You'd really? People, yeah, you get people would like on Snapchat or something, or like God. there'd be a thing, and they'd be like, "I just saw him the other day." He's a fucking <laughs> creature. Yeah, dude, it's so funny. Had like, a good he's, run. He's he did. So disgusting. God. No, that guy's a monster. He's so disgusting. It was like a, it was like a. Point. It's a cartoon. It was a point made in court. They were like, "You're telling me this guy didn't rape these? Look how." Yeah. Disgusting. Oh, really? That was yeah, the yeah, defense. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at the guy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think these bras are saying yes and, to him. They were just like showing pictures of him as a person. Yeah. And the jury, <laughs> they were like, I don't know. I don't know. If <laughs> we got to get a picture of his dick out. <laughs> like, that it was. The, yeah, 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 his yeah, penis yeah. was like a big talking point. Yeah. yeah. Oh, God. That was like the closing argument. It's like, look at this dick. Yeah. yeah. It was like, fuck it. What was that? Tarantino's dick in that Grindhouse movie. <laughs> just melting off. You remember? Yeah. It was, it, like, was that too deep of a reference? No, yeah. Because what? Robert Rodriguez. <laughs> Planet Terror, anybody? Um, I've gone too deep. I'm sorry. Tarantino's has a melting dick in a movie. Mm. Yeah, it's uh, it's the only time he ever actually, I think, uh, looked bad in a movie because he's also the same dude I saw recently. He was also the same dude that wrote a script and then cast himself to have Salma Hayek put her, t- her toes oh, in Oh, I his saw mouth. that, where he yeah. like, tr- drinks the, uh, oh, the vodka. Yeah, yeah. yeah, from Dust Till Dawn? Yeah, yeah. which is my other sexual awakening. Dude, oh that's my God. And her he with is, a snake? Yes, that's ma- she's maybe the hottest in any movie, of ever. <clears throat> That's an Selma Hayek and Dust Dust Till Dawn. Yeah, I yeah. also. There's no one weird, hotter. Than and, yeah. and weird we're, argument: the chick that pops out of the cake and under siege. But <laughs> who knows her name? No way. Dude. Yeah, she she just did it for me. I think that's a personal thing. That's just because you yeah. were younger. Wow. Well, yeah, early nineties. First term Clinton. What were you guys yes. doing? <laughs> I was changing my jerseys. <laughs> yeah, exactly. What's yeah? What also? What's what's the name of that lady that was in? Uh, you ever see Trading Places? Yeah, with uh, fucking twelve-year-old Lindsay Lohan. No, no, no. no. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah take it easy. with uh, Eddie Murphy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What's oh, the name of know, it? Well, uh, she was like a hermaphrodite or something. People said, "Boy George." No, no, no. But she's so hot. It's a great point yeah. so far. <laughs> <laughs> You're not uh, selling. Well, this is horrible. Yeah. No, she was goalie in hockey. Here's, yeah, yeah, here's another name. one. Was uh, I also don't think Sam Hayek is beat yet, but. Uh, Cameron Diaz in the mask. Yeah, she was. Yes. That was like peak stuff. Yeah, but she's like, de- like that's kind of like Angelic. Zeta Jones and Zorro. That's dude, that's up there. That's up there. That's up yeah. there. And that's number he, two. Dude, she. I watched Entrapment because of that bitch. Oh yeah, bad movie. The point under, is, blondes the don't make the cut. No, I'm. I don't you like gotta have a little no. fucking a pizzazz in yeah, your skin, dark, yeah. and you gotta I be mean, rounded. Yeah, Pamela yeah. Anderson 
Nah. In the 90s. Nah, that's a county fair too, of a woman. Like, uh, it's like... So hot, dude. Yeah, it's too, like, fake. But also, like, I'm not going to sit here and say, like, not for Of me, course. Right? But, you like... Listen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Carmen Electra? That's now she... Again, Cincinnati same thing. County fair. Cincinnati gave you that. Really? And some plastic surgery. Dude, these, <laughs> the <laughs> other yeah. girls are princesses. They're state fairs. Dude. You're talking county fair bitches. Carmen right? Electra. Well, no, Salma Hayek off the rack was that. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah, like, there yeah, wasn't yeah. anything... Look at her true. now. I know. Yeah. You, you follow her on IG? It's She's coming out of the water you know the other day. all natural? It's all natural. 100%. Still natural. Yeah. What is going on? Penelope Cruz had a nice run. Penelope too. Cruz, She's number three. Attractive. Let's yeah. go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another little pizzazz on the skin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You understand? Um, dark hair, dark eyes, pizzazz. Yeah. What about I the love, you know who I love now is my number one is, um, fuck, what, in Blade Runner, the chick, Ana de Armas. Oh, I love yes. her. Dude. I know her ass. I don't uh, remember. She was in the first Knives Out movie. Uh, Did you see that one? No. She's like... She's, she's in weird. You'd have to have seen the movies, but she's a fucking. She's in Blade smoke. Runner. She's, she's like the, the chick in Blade Runner. Yeah, Did you yeah. see the new remember. Blade Runner? I don't this remember. is your whole style. Yeah. I know. <laughs> well, listen, I the, believe you. She's yeah. the AI like robot yeah, yes, chick that yes. is talking to oh, Gosling. Yes. Hold on. What's the AI movie? The robot. Oh, Hot robot. robot. No. Yeah, no. Uh, ex Machina. Yeah, ex Machina. Oh, Machina. That, that robot. Chick yes. Is uh, that is somebody? Is that her? Hold on. No, no. No, that's a super hot actress, though. Yeah, that... uh, she's like from like Finland or something. Or she's... No, she's been in some shit. Yeah, she was in. She was. <laughs> Ex Machina, dude. That is a yes. nice great little 90 minute ripper, too. Great, yes. like, great Whoa, movie. What's dude. going yes. on? That's it, what that's what lit that dude up, right? Was um, that his big movie? His first big movie? Oh, you're right. Uh, uh, no, no. No, he had a couple of You're friends. right. Alicia Vell. Yeah, you're right. I don't know who that bitch, that yeah, bitch is, yeah, but yeah. I would fuck her yeah. <laughs> as a robot. God. Um, so Oscar Isaac. Oscar, yeah, or Isaac, Oscar, 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 no, Isaac. Oscar Isaac. No, Oscar yeah, Isaac. He's good. A he's... Most Violent Year was actually a sneaky good movie. Yes. Uh, I don't know, dude. It was he... slow, though. Nothing really. No happened. payoff. Yeah. But, There's no payoff. So in there that. was a couple scenes where you, I just remember being like, this is the guy for a little bit, though. Yeah. You're like, yeah. the act. Which also, no, the acting was great. The story was great until the end, and then you're like, that's it? Yeah, that's true. It let yeah. you down. Third act was whatever. I, yeah, he's a, he's a good actor, though. First of all, I just had that, that, uh, um, he's hot. That moment with, yeah. Aesthetically pleasing. Yeah. I could say that as a man. Joey Burrow, Oscar Isaac. I call them both. Hot. Hot. <laughs> um, just for the story. Um, you know who I just had that revelation with too, which sucks, was like when you saw Oscar Isaac earlier, like this dude is going to be around for like 20 years. I just thought that watching Creed 3 with Jonathan Majors, and then he started hitting bitches. Yeah. Now wow. he's done. Really? Yeah. That's the quickest downfall ever. But I was yeah. like, dude, I, I watched, I, if you watch Creed 3, I was like, dude, this guy is the man. He's gonna be a great actor, and now he's like, yeah. And he Wait, was he's, like, he's he's hated to be in some shit, dude. He's it was, yeah. There's he one bad the... one, and then it was one of those where like now four other chicks are like, oh, he's been doing this, oh, and man. it. And then there's a video, no. so they they, yeah. So he was like, the video's gonna exonerate me. Then the video got out. They haven't showed the public yet, but now he's like getting canceled off projects and shit like that. So it's like, what's know. his face yelling at his pregnant wife? Oh yeah, yeah, fucking uh, What's Crowder, Crowder, Crowder with Crowder, Jay Crowder, <laughs> no, you Steve see, Crowder. You know, you know uh, yeah. What's his uh, his Steve, whole thing? I don't. Steve, I think it's Stephen. Crowder. None Who of our brains. Actor? Listen, no, our like brains a, aren't he's working like a, today. He's like a conservative, like YouTube guy. Oh, nice. He does like comedy. But yeah, that's tough. Yeah, it's anytime it's, it's he it's does bad. comedy, it's bad. It's like no, it's all hard right politics. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Nobody gives a shit. About, I mean, a lot don't, of people do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Most most he's of like, the country, but yeah. he's like huge. Yeah. But he anyway, like, he, yeah. yeah, video came out with him like abusing his his girl. That's on yeah. a Fucking he's, ring. It's gonna be a quick downfall every time that comes. I don't know yeah, though. Don't his know. audience is like his audience. I think is true. Is, is this might give him a boost, him a boost I mean, in yeah. numbers. They're yeah. not gonna Ray Rice him. They're gonna elevate him. No, no, no. They're gonna Joe Mixon him. Maybe give him another chance. Draft him late. Shout out to the Bengals. Joe Mixon. Yeah, he was the Bengal, wasn't he? He still is. Is he still? Yeah. He was like eighteen. She called him the young lady hit her in the face. Oh yeah, that I was. Also, down I was kind of, I, I was kind of in on him being able to have a second thing on that. It wasn't yeah, like, a also, it wasn't yeah. like a yeah. domestic. And violence. if I remember from that video, he was like, "Don't stop saying that." Yeah, no, stop it was like a, it was that. a whole conversation. Stop and, saying that. And, and she, she went, kept like, yeah. And then he was like, "All right, <laughs> all right, <laughs> we can do this the easy way. We can do this the hard way. I'll give you a little taste of the hard way." Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I don't only you know hit holes, like. sweetheart. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Good lord! <laughs> they call me a crackback running back for a reason. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? You got anything to plug, buddy? Uh, just start a podcast. You know what I'm saying? Uh, with uh, myself solo. So just look me up on. IG Turner Comedy on Instagram and all the links are there. 
Um, I do a bunch on YouTube. I go to like, so I went to the Knicks game and I do like pregame shit with the fans. Yeah, yeah. So I did one with the Clippers recently. They went pretty good on on IG. So those are super fun. I got all those on YouTube. So hit me on YouTube. All the links are at Turner Comedy on Instagram. Dude, Fuck the fucking with me. the fucking Bangles. Yeah, the I pictures. do Bangles videos every year. Dude, he sends. I don't know how do you do this, but it's he a, just sends tiger pics to people yeah. like uh, like. To the opposing team's yeah. fans. So if we were playing day. the Eagles, I'd get your number randomly, and I'd, I would wouldn't. just text you <laughs> once a day a single photo of a Bengal tiger in its natural <laughs> habitat. <laughs> no words attached. The whole week, and Nothing. people spend. And they're like, dude. "Wrong number. Who is this? Day one." <laughs> and then day two is just, and they're beautiful pictures. I get like HD shit. Like they're like stunning <laughs> photos of tigers, and not in the zoo. I'm not talking like I'm talking natty habitats, yeah. like natty. <laughs> Yeah, and, looking uh, through the leaves. And then like so, so then, they, and then, and then, yeah, like out the leaves. And then Friday comes around and they re- they start to click. They're like, we're playing the fucking Bengals this week. And then they're like, fuck you, you fucking cocksucker. And it gets nasty, dude. People leave voice messages. Dude, um, that rules. It is very fun. It's and then so I'll fun. and then I'll take it at the end do of the week. Just, do you guess? And like- I video it uh uh say again. Nice. I'm sorry. Finish. It. Well, no. And then I'll then I'll like screenshot it and I'll talk over it like yeah. IG video yeah. and like break down That's the great. week of the highlights. So do like people send you numbers <laughs> so to I, fuck? So now so it's I, big enough. So now I crowdsource the numbers. So on a on a Monday after the game, <laughs> send me your boys. <laughs> number. I'm like anybody know any Patriots fans? <laughs> Boom. Now the the tough weeks are like <laughs> Texans fans. Like those weird, like yeah, yeah, we, yeah, I think we played the no one gives a fuck Jaguars about the Texans. or the Dolphins yeah. this year, and it's like. Ugh. Yeah. But they're fine. They're actually. But the nice thing is, like, I'll put myself over it and I'll just make fun of their fan base as a whole. Um, <laughs> but how did you start? Like, how did you start the process? So fun. I did this. Like, this is probably like ten years ago. There's a comic that I know in Phoenix, Sierra, and uh, she is a Raiders fan. And we were playing in Week One, and I don't know why, but I was like, I'm gonna just text this bitch once a day. <laughs> photos of a tiger and she didn't know it was me <laughs> yeah. and i remember thinking and then i put it on facebook to like it was like that was when she realized it was me all week and i tagged her and i was like been fucking with you blah blah, blah. but it was very funny and people engaged and i was like i could do this yeah. every week and this was so this is actually you know what it was it was actually 2015 and we were actually fucking good if you remember that was the year that we ended up losing to the steelers and the pac-man is that fight. when he flipped did, did, did the flip into the end zone who was drum, the drum nugs <laughs> simpson uh <laughs> no that was the most amazing highlight in the history of sports arguably he landed that flip but that was yeah. like 0809 bad team but that was a yeah. great great moment um no but 2015 i did it and we were actually good and i did it every week and then i just po- would post the screenshots on facebook and then i didn't do it for a while and I was like, "Fuck it, I could probably do this on IG," and uh, it's su- it is it's, fun. Dude, I appreciate you saying because so it's funny. also a lot of work. Yeah, like every day. I should actually have it. Like some people on Reddit, they it went viral on one of the um, Ravens boards when we did the Ravens Week One, and they were like, "He's probably doing this," and I'm reading what I probably should be doing. I'm like, "Oh, sh- definitely should be doing that." Like yeah, automating yeah, yeah. the pictures every day through yeah. something yes. else. Yeah, yeah. They're like, "This is probably what he's doing. It's very easy." Blah blah blah. And I'm but like, it's so what funny. Do I, do? I want to message that guy. Like, what should I be doing? <laughs> <laughs> I'm literally sitting on the shitter for 40 minutes, so my knees are fucking weak. Like texting everybody, <laughs> telling my girl, "Like, I'll be out in a little bit. What are you doing? <laughs> do <Doing> what? <laughs> <Doing work. laughs> and some dude will be spazzing. He'll just text, send him like a picture of a tiger, like scratches. And <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. If they get me, like I got a couple. Like, yeah, like there's one with the tiger. Yeah, I could. I, I. I know how to communicate through photos of tigers. <laughs> yeah. It's actually kind of nuanced at this point. I got one. If it's going wrong, I got a tiger fucking a tiger. You want that? You want to make it go that route? You don't want these problems, big guy. I got one. If we're playing the buffaloes, I got a tiger eating the ass of a... It's a wildebeest, clearly, yeah, but yeah. you don't know that. Yeah. Um, so... Yeah, that's my yeah. If you're a Bengals fan, fuck with your boy. Yeah, yeah. This year I'm trying to. So I'm not trying to. I'm going to when the schedule comes out. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do a tour where every road game, and I'll do a show that weekend of the Bengals games. Fuck yeah. So it'll be eight or I don't know. I think they got eight road games this year. Nice. Fuck yeah. So it'll be fun. Well, well you, thanks for coming, yeah, dude. Yeah. yeah, appreciate you guys.